the Indians have won Oscars before, the 95th Academy Awards turned out to be a historic moment for Indian cinema. For the first time, two Indian films were conferred with the prestigious Oscar award. The electrifying song Natu Natu from Bahubali famed director S.S. Rajamouli's blockbuster RRR bagged the Best Original Song Award, while Kartiki Gonsalves' The Elephant Whisperers won the Oscar for the Best Documentary Short Film. While RRR needs no introduction, Incredible Tale from Neil Giri's The Elephant Whisperers has now hogged the limelight. Produced by Achin Jan and Guneet Monga, this short film describes a special bond between a couple with their orphaned elephants in Tamil Nadu. In her 41-minute documentary, Kartiki Gonsalves followed a family which had adopted injured baby elephants. The story takes the audience on a mesmerizing ride into the woods of Thepakadu camp in Mudumalai Tiger Reserve. Raghu and Bomi are the elephants on which the entire film is themed around. Raghu was separated from its herd after its mother died. Belly was entrusted with the responsibility of Raghu, although she had no prior experience of taking care of elephants. Every year, at least some two to three elephant scarves are being orphaned. In the crowd from the herd, they are being orphaned. The main motive of our department uh, officials and uh, foresters and guards is to reunite the calves to the herd itself. And 90% we succeed by that. We reunite the calves. Nearly a meager 10%, sometimes we are unable to reunite because we find it difficult to locate the herd. Sometimes the mother is found dead or sometimes we find it difficult to find the herd in that such a dense forest. And in that case, when it's being uh, getting when it's getting late the calves do not get any kind of nutrition and uh, and that should not be fatal to the calves itself so what do we do is we uh, keep the calves in our uh, camps so we have nearly three camps in around tamil in, in tamil nadu from we have it in mudumalai we have it in uh, top slope and we have another camp in uh, trichy so in mudumalai every every year at least two calves are being offered and uh, this uh, Bowman in uh, Belly. For Bowman, taking care of Raghu was his first step in continuing the family's legacy as Mahons. The couple took great pains to ensure that the fragile, injured infant Tusker survives and grows into a healthy juvenile. Later, Raghu got a new sibling, Bowman a new calf that Bowman and Belly were assigned to take care of. By raising Bomi and Raghu, Bowman and Belly became the first couple to raise two orphaned elephants in South India successfully. Now Raghu and Bomi have become the center of attraction for the Mudumalai Thepakadu Elephant Camp. Just a day after the documentary won Oscar, a large number of tourists thronged the national park to get a glimpse of the famous jumbos. So I'm from London in England and um, we're, we're visiting the area and we heard about the elephants um, and we wanted to come and see them because they're my favourite animal. And yeah, yeah, like this. So what, what, what is this baby elephant? What do you know about them? Oh, um, they won an Oscar last night and that's very exciting and yeah, so we came to see them and see what they're doing. People across India are now much curious about these elephants whose story has made it to the Oscars. The documentary not only brought laurels to the country, it has also highlighted the deep-rooted culture and efforts of India's elephant conservation.